Hey guys, in this video, I will show you how you can change default system font in Windows 11. So without further ado, let's get started. First of all, what you need to go on search and then you just need to write fonts, right? Write fonts and then you need to pick the font that you want to change. So in my case, let's uh, let's look for the font and let's change it to uh, Corbel, right? Corbel. So just write the name on your notes and later we will need that particular name. Then what you need to do here is to write registry editor, right click on it, run as admin. And first thing what I suggest to do here is to uh, go to file and uh, export and back, just have a backup on your desktop in case you did something wrong. So for example, let's name it fonts and later you can go to file, import and change it uh, back if you something if you did something wrong then you need to go to hk local machine then you need to go to software on software you need to go to microsoft scroll down until you see microsoft then expand microsoft then go to uh, uh, and look uh, for windows nt so let's go on the bottom here it should be somewhere windows nt option Windows NT, then you need to look for current version and then you need to look for fonts, right? Current version and then fonts, right? And you will see all the fonts that is available on your computer here. And then we just need to look for the font that we selected. In my case, it's Corbel. So let's look for Corbel here. And once you find a Corbel, you just need to just copy the this little thing here and paste it because we will need this uh, later and the next thing we need to do here you can close registry editor then right click on your uh, desktop then show more options new text document then you can give it a name it really doesn't matter for example uh, corbel something like that and then you just need to open this uh, notepad then you just need to paste the code that i will give you in the video description below and then you just need to copy TTF uh, document, not document name, and then you just need to paste it here, right? And then what you need to do here is to simply go to file, and then you need to select save and uh, or save as. I'm sorry, and then you just need to just name it R R R I G, right? Uh, reg and make sure to save it as all files, right? And then uh, you need to, after you save it, you need to locate that particular file on your desktop. And once you find it, you just need to right click on it and open it or uh, merge it if open not available for you. Then press okay, and then press okay here. And after that, as you can see here, you just need to restart your computer and the font will be available. If you want to change it back, you just need to select fonts here that we just backed up on the register editor and you need to do the same and your fonts will go back. So yeah, that's basically it. If I help you out, please press like button and subscribe for more. Take care. Bye.